<clears throat> Good morning, friends and family. So this morning, I'm going to show you how I make my keto coffee. Um, I want you to see that it has medium chain triglycerides um, through the grass-fed butter. It also has collagen in it. And collagen is really, really good for your skin and for your organs. Um, collagen helps the elasticity of your skin and it helps internally to kind of give your organs um, some cushion. And um, as you can see, it's also non-GMO. This is something that you can take on the go and blend it up however you want, wherever you want. It sends your body into ketostasis and it is a soy free formula so we're not going to have any soy boys running around um and so i opened this because it's hard to um open things one-handed <clears throat> so um ah, it doesn't want to actually open now isn't that crazy i'm putting you down for a second everyone all right so it's a powder okay I'm just going to dump my powder into the cup and I went down to our local um, convenience store it's called Turkey Hill and I got a pumpkin spice mixed with regular coffee latte and <clears throat> so what I do is I take and I pour just a little bit in at first okay and excuse my my runny nose this weather always seems to um get my sinuses really crazy um the reason why i do it this way is because i really really like to get it blended as well as possible first okay and it seems to blend better when there's less and there's still going to be some stuff, but it's, um, it'll all go away. It's 4.30 in the morning, guys. Good morning. Welcome to Jen's Coffee Club. And, um, a lot of people like to drink this, <clears throat> keto coffee, um, through a straw with a lid over top of the coffee cup so they don't have to see what they're actually drinking. And I kind of agree. Um, only because, you know, sometimes things can be, when they're new, they can be a little off-putting. Um, sometimes people aren't as adventurous as I would like them to be. And stuff like this gets them nervous. When they can see like chunks and they don't like that but me personally i already know what's going on here and i love this stuff because it'll give me the pep that i need for the day and because i make my own little blend like today i use the um the pumpkin spice latte and regular coffee i did a, a, a mixture of half coffee and half um of the stuff that comes out of the machine it's already mixed and um, pumpkin spice really works well it blends well with the um, taste of the keto coffee so it's all mixed up and it's pretty well mixed it could be better but the coffee isn't as hot um, so that's no big deal and um, you can see and it's kind of weird, but this stuff here on the side of the cup is the collagen, I'm pretty sure. And I'm telling you guys, <clears throat> I know we don't do too many selfies and stuff. Um, I take a selfie almost every day um, when I'm working and stuff like that. Um, but usually... I, um, I don't, I don't do full body selfies. It took me a second to remember where I was going with this. Excuse me, guys. 
That's just a sign that I need a sip of keto real quick. Um, that was me making a mess right before I poured the coffee. <laughs> um, I was talking about selfies and how I don't really do selfies, but... Um, pretty soon here I am going to do a selfie and I'm going to show you a picture of what I used to be and what I am now. And you'll see that I am definitely losing weight. I'm so happy to be getting good stuff into my body that, um, it, it helps my body to correct Whatever was going on, I could never lose weight. I did crunches, I did sit-ups, I can do um, a plank, which is kind of like a push-up. Without actually doing a push-up, you're just holding yourself in that position. Um, I ran, I biked. I remember one summer, um, I decided that I was going to, I was probably like 12 or 13 years old, and I was going to wake up at eight o'clock every morning and I was going to bike until I had to come in to, um, before the street lamps at night. So <clears throat> I spent this entire summer doing absolutely nothing but biking up and down the streets of our neighborhood and drinking water. And I would come in to eat and my dad would be like, aren't you going to eat? And I say, oh, I'm not hungry. Usually in the summertime, I'm not hungry. Um, so I was, I was, you know, working out all summer long, bike riding and trying to burn calories and just drinking water. And I ended the summer heavier than I started the summer. And I was so upset. I was so frustrated. And, um, my dad, you know, he kind of made fun of me a little bit. And, um, it was heart, it was heartbreaking. It really was. I felt like nothing I was going to do was ever going to make a difference. And, um, and then, you know, I started doing the It Works in August, I think. And I was a size 16. Nobody wants to be a size 16. And then I had a C-section with my son and, um, in 2011, I had them go back into the C-section, um, because something was wrong with my ovary, and my left side ovary was, um, infected. I'm not sure how. I don't know what happened. Um, they never had any answers for me. Um, <clears throat> so, my ovary was infected, and they had to go in through the same um, area that they did my C-section. So I had kind of a double whammy. I had two operations in the same, very, very same section cut through the same, um, skin and muscles. And I just was so beside myself because I just knew, I knew, right. That I was never, ever, ever going to, um, lose this weight. I was never going to be able to get those muscles in any kind of shape where it would be weight loss. And that was in 2011. So when I started in, started at works in August, um, I really was just into it because I needed the greens and the greens are like my be best friend. I absolutely love the greens. Um, and <clears throat> this is the mixed berry greens, um, and I really just wanted nutrients. I didn't care about anything else, um, and by default, getting the right nutrients into me and, you know, some keto coffee in the morning to get the engine going, by far helped. I'm a size 10 now, so, um, that's just a little bit about my products and what I've got. If you're interested, um, please become a loyal customer so you can pay wholesale prices. Um, the, the loyal customer program is awesome. After three months of being a loyal customer, um, you get $50, uh, product points back from the company. And then after six months of being a loyal customer, you get an additional $50. 
And then after a year, they celebrate a year of your loyalty by giving you $150 in product points. And we don't have just keto or just greens. We have a skincare line. We have some clothing. Um, there is um, um, nutritional line. So, you know, vitamins and stuff like that that will help with, you know, with your greens and everything like that. So there's a lot more than just the keto and just the greens. Um, there's protein shakes for those guys that are into working out. There's, there's a lot of stuff. Um, so if you're interested, my description will be in the link below. Um, and <clears throat> excuse me, It'll be in the link below for you to follow, so just follow my link, and at the end of your order, when you're done and you're about ready to purchase, make sure to sign up as a loyal customer, and you'll pay wholesale prices. When you're on the website, you're going to notice that there's two different prices. One price is the wholesale price, and one price is the retail price, and you're going to notice that there's a significant difference, so... um. Make sure to sign up as a loyal customer, okay, guys? All right, well, that's everything I have for you this morning. Welcome to Coffee Club. I hope you're enjoying your favorite warm beverage. I hope you're giving thanks to the Lord. I thank the Lord for you guys, and I thank the Lord that you guys put up with me every morning. Um, um, make sure to keep your armor on, and make sure to be vigilant watch watchmen watch because we are near the end and it's going to get crazy so pick up some keto so you can stay alert some keto coffee so you can stay alert <laughs> i love you guys and stay blessed